right, so here we go with round one. Seems to be a throwback type of matchup here. The classically trained striker taking on the Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu black belt. But BJJ black belt with this guy, that didn't begin to describe his credentials. It does not describe how good he is. His vast knowledge of all the Jiu-Jitsu positions. This guy, once you're on the ground, there is no place where you are safe. You are constantly getting attacked. He's always throwing up submissions. He's always attacking arms. He's always attacking your neck doing everything to try and make you think submission's coming, even if it's just to change positions to secure top. Look at him whip his hip into that kick. The slip and then the counter by Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by the gentleman. Oh, just out of range with that punch attempt. Well, DC, headgear's not allowed, but he has raised the hands, and he's doing a nice job protecting the dome. He's doing a great job of blocking his head. A lot of times, those shots to the head will knock you out. Not this time. This guy's making sure nothing lands. Well, he's been good tonight, but he missed with that one. Very tricky. Throws that body kick. And now trying to take the back. Oh, big punch land. Well, for years, Tyron Woodley had said Jorge Masvidal is the best boxer on this UFC roster. Certainly showed you the hands there. DC. I mean, he's showing it, man. I mean, this, I mean, he's showing it, John. This guy has an ability to stand and box anyone in the UFC. And that was on full display when he beat Nate Diaz. Digging kick. Really good body kick. Under 90 seconds now to go in round one. All right, so a good job defensively by him here as he raises the guard and prevents any damage. Shades of James Tony. Always seeing things coming at him. He's such a great defensive fighter. Under a minute to go in our opening round. Big powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Right hook to the head, what? Twenty seconds left. Oh, nice job there to land the knee strike to the body again, making great use of his length in this matchup. The horn sounds for the end of round one. The volume has waned a little bit. All right, a lot of tremendous striking action in that last round, DC. I know you don't have a telestrator, but take us through the replay. I mean, I would love to have my telestrator right now. That was a great display of high-level... Let's shake it off. We need to do exactly... Round two is upon us. Your thoughts on round one, champ? Round one was a very close round. Both guys had their moments, but nobody has really went out ahead in the race as we go into the second round. Over and over, he's landed these big body kicks. Ooh, he landed a huge hook there. <laughs> nice kick. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to connect on a lot of shots to the midsection, and these will take their toll as this fight goes into the ladder round. Nice defense there, huge block. Wow. Back to the feet now. Swing and a miss with that punch by Gamebred. 
All right, well, he's landed some good shots tonight, but there's no three-piece, there's no soda. More often than not, it's one and done. He's not even getting a combination. I mean, hey. if you're going to sit there at the drive-thru, <laughs> order a combination, take the soda with your food, give him the right hand behind the jab, give him the hook behind the right hand. Jab, right hand, hook, that's two pieces of chicken and a biscuit. Finish him off with the uppercut. That is your soda. I mean, come on, man. Let this guy have the whole thing. Oh, made good use of his size there as he lands the flush knee. So just over 20 total strikes have now landed for Jorge Masvidal. Well, two out of every 10 is not what you're looking for. Landing just 21% accuracy here against Jorge Masvidal. Able to check that kick as well. Well, he's really starting to land a high number of strikes here in the second round. No denying that he has taken the message from his corner and picked up the pace here in round two. That is, oh man, this dude is good. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Final minute. Oh, significant strike attempt there, but a huge block. Thirty seconds now to go in the round. Gamebred gets hit with a kick here. That one landed flush. Let's see if he can make some adjustments. Pretty good straight punch there by Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Ten minutes. Let's check out some of the action now from that previous round, and he really kept finding a home for those kicks. Yeah, and why would you change it? If your opponent is not... All right, next round is now underway. Previous round, not necessarily a tough act to follow. Pretty good, not good. Pretty good round, but not the best round. Sometimes that's what you get when you have fighters that are so evenly matched. Big plus hands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? That is a killer jab there from Jorge Gamebred Masvidal. Big picture might be the best boxer on this roster. I mean, he may just be the best boxer on this Oh! He's hurt. He's got hurt here. Oh, and he lands another huge knee there as the taller fighter uses his length well yet again. Oh, nasty cut there right on the bridge of the nose. Nice one-two there. Well, not only is he slow, he needs to start looking to finish now because he's got his opponent hurt very fast. And they strike till the end. Cable of inches right there, boy. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Attempts the front kick there. And he landed the right hand there. Oh, huge block. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Yes, they heard him in the last round. Same exact one. So there he is after a monumental knockout turned in here tonight. That is one they will be talking about for quite some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at two minutes, 54 seconds of round number three. Declaring the winner by knockout, Jorge Gabriel Well, there will be no...
go. Shutting that smile off tonight. The celebration is on as he gets a huge win by knockout tonight. I got to think there are a few... Take it to the